right, so today what we're going to do is we're going to do a versus video between the DeWalt and Craftsman brushless hammer drill. All right, now this is the mid-range for the DeWalt. DeWalt makes a few more powerful, extremely powerful hammer drills. Now, the DeWalt Power Detect is the most powerful battery-operated hammer drill that I've tested. This is the mid-range one. They also have the uh, 996 and the FlexVolt Advantage. As you can see, both of these look very identical. We will be using the 4 amp hour battery. Both of these are made by the same company. I believe Stan Lee actually makes both of these. So let's go over the specs of these really quick and see how these actually go against each other. For the DeWalt first, this is model number DCD796, half inch fully metal chuck. Uh, this goes, uh, this has on speed two, zero to 34,000 beats per minute. And on speed two, zero to 2,000 RPM. And on speed one, zero to 550. I'll put the torque in right now. This has a 13 point clutch plus two, which the plus two is drill and hammer. And yes, this does have the 20 minute work light LED if you switch it to that and it's brighter. Also has the half dim and regular, it'll stand for a few seconds when you pull the trigger. Four amp hour regular XR battery, the battery is full brushless motor and so yeah that is the DeWalt and there you go all right so next is the Craftsman this is model number CMC D721 half inch fully metal chuck this goes of course it's a brushless hammer drill this goes to 35,700 beats per minute so then the RPM is 2100 on speed 2 and then 600 on speed 1 this has a 13 point clutch plus two, which the plus two is hammer and drill. Anything outside of that is just uh, the regular screw for the clutch. I guess a four amp hour battery, the battery is a full. They both have a three bar system instead of a four bar system. This does have like a, it's a work light. It's a LED light on the base, but that's actually pretty pathetic. I will admit that, but yeah. When it comes to comfort wise, I would, would say the DeWalt. The, the DeWalt does feel a little bit better than the hand because you feel you feel this design, you know, like in your fingers. Like if you press down, it'll act uh, for a while, it'll actually engrave it into your, uh, your skin. So yeah. We will sp uh, brush this motor. So let's see what these can do against each other. All right, so first what we're gonna do is one eight inch timber lock each. All right, so first let's do, uh, actually I wanna do the Craftsman first. Speed two, we'll uh, show you guys one more time. Battery is full. All right, so ready, go. Time. That is for the Craftsman, it's on drill. That's on speed two, it's on drill. Sorry, speed two, it's on drill. Let's do the DeWalt next. Right here is good. All right, so ready, go. Oh, ready, go. Time. All right, let's take the, I'm sorry if I didn't show you the battery. Battery's full on the DeWalt. Let's take the Craftsman's out. Ready, go. Time. I'll stop the timer at the right time. Right, let's take out the DeWalt's. All right, so ready, go. Time. I do not know what the test results are until I edit the video. But let's uh, upgrade to uh, a four inch lag. All right, so we're gonna drive in four inch, uh, one four inch lag each. All drills require speed one on this because it's just two, it requires a lot of torque. Ready, go. A little bit more. Time. That is time. All right, speed one is required. Right there is good. All right, so ready, go. Time, it did it. This task is, this task strips this qu that quarter inch X side. It does. This task is bad for these bits, but that's why I do these tests, so you don't have to. All right, so ready, go. There we go. 
time. It was able to take it out. All right, let's do the the Dewalt. All right, so ready? Go. Yep. Will you fail? Nope. Did it. Time. All right, let's uh, switch up to the six inch lags, the same size. All right, so let's do the Craftsman first. Right here is good. This is gonna be a tough one. This is gonna be a tough one. It's on speed one, it's on drill. All right, so ready? Go. They might not be able to do it. Oh, that's where it cut out. All right, that's where it cut out. We're gonna stop that there. First, because first I wanna see if the DeWalt could do it all the way. Right here, it's on speed one, it's on drill. Right here is good. All right, so, ready, go. Oh, that's where the DeWalt cuts out. Too bad. So the Craftsman actually beat it when it comes to this. All right, first we're gonna see if the Craftsman could drive in a one and a half inch speed bore. This is gonna be a tough one. This is gonna be a tough one. Speed one, we'll do a uh, test on speed two. I doubt it, but just uh, to see. Uh, if it fails, it fails. I'm not gonna judge it. This is just a test to see if it could actually could do it. Ready, go. Nope. Speed one is required. All right, let's go down here. A little bit more. There we go. All right, so ready, go. Time. Time. Just so you guys know, I do not put pressure down. I just, uh, I hold my stance so I don't lose control of the tool. All right, let's do the De uh, the DeWalt. It was able to do a one and a half inch speed bore, which that's still pretty impressive. All right, let's see if the DeWalt could do the same. Right here, oh, we'll do a test right here on speed two, see if it can. Ready, go. Nope, nope, it cannot. Speed one, it's on drill. Right here is good. All right, so ready, go. What the heck? I'm not even, I'm not even locking it. All right, let's do that again. Right here is good. All right, ready, go. Time. It did it. All right, so that's pretty much it for wood. Let's go to concrete and see how well these do. Drilling into that. Let's see what this can do. Now we are gonna use a pre-drilled hole. I think right here is good. And we'll do the other hole right, uh, the Dewalt right there. You're using half inch uh, Milwaukee bits. I believe these are Milwaukee. All right, so ready, go. Let it let it loose. That's no good. No good, craftsman. All right, let's continue. Let's uh, vacuum that up. Let's see if that is good. 
it can go a half inch more. So let's continue. Time. There we go. Let's do the DeWalt's right there. Speed two. Battery is full. Right here is good. All right, so ready? Go. Let's vacuum that up really quick, then we'll continue. All right, uh, same thing, about a half inch more. Continue. Time. That is the test between these two. All right, so when it comes to these two, these, these two are still cold. 78 degrees, 70, 83. 83 degrees for the... DeWalt, 76, 71, and 79 for the Craftsman. So they're both still cold, all right? So that not much has changed for that. All right, so when it comes to performance-wise, I do not know what the test results are until I edit the video, but I can definitely tell you that the DeWalt does have a bit uh, more better of a performance when it comes to the tool itself. But this is the DeWalt's mid-range, and this is Craftsman, I think, their best hammer drill that they have, I think. And so this DeWalt is actually pretty weak compared to its bigger brothers. It is severely weak compared to its bigger brothers. So I just want to do a versus video of these two to show you guys the difference between the two if you needed the information to help you decide what battery uh, system you wanted to buy in. So that's pretty much it. I hope you guys found this video helpful and entertaining. Please like this video. Please hit the bell button to be notified of future videos. And please subscribe to the channel. This is Dave Nicholas. Thank you for tuning in. I'll see you guys next time.